Hey everyone, Techno Major here with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your iPhone if it keeps on showing the Apple logo and turning off. You want to follow these steps. So let's get started. The very first troubleshooting when it comes to this is that you want to make sure your phone has good charge. And by that, I mean you want to charge for at least 30 minutes to one hour of charge. You want to charge it with a charger that's good. And if you don't have this, you want to use a wireless charger. And sometimes what happens is the charger may be bad and your phone might not be getting the charge. So try replacing your charger or using a different charger. Sometimes this block can go bad or the cable you may need to replace that or use a different charger as to charging it. Now, for some reason it's not working. You can also try a wireless charger. And the reason why it's if the charge port is broken or is not working, it might not work. Another thing you might want to consider with the charge port here is sometimes there might be dust, lint, or basically dirt built up to it. So you have to go over with the flashlight to make sure there isn't anything and take a pick or something that's not a metal or anything. You want to go ahead and make sure it's cleaned out or just simply blow on it or use compressed air to clean it out and make sure it's not wet or anything as well. So that's going to be the first thing when it comes to fixing it is to make sure it has charge. Now, once you know the charge is good, it's not the charge port, you want to follow this step, which is you're going to quickly press and release the volume up and then quickly press and release the volume down and then hold on to the side button until screen goes completely black this time and the Apple logo shows up again and you'll let go. So we're going to do quickly press and release volume up, volume down, and then I hold on to the side button just like this. And you're going to keep on holding until it goes completely black and the Apple logo doesn't appear. And then you're going to wait for the Apple logo to reappear again after it has gone completely black and then let go. And that should go ahead and force the phone software to completely shut down, reload the code. So if it's a software related issue, it's going to go ahead and fix it. Keep in mind after you, of course, make sure the phone is charged for at least half an hour to one hour and then do that. And if it doesn't work the very first time, keep on trying this method. It does work. You're going to keep on pressing and releasing quickly volume up, volume down, and then hold on to the side button again. Sometimes it will take you 10, 15 tries, especially if it's your very first time to get the hang of it. The key thing is to quickly press and release the volume up and then volume down and then hold on to the side button until you can get the screen to go completely black. And then once the Apple logo reappears again, you'll let go of it. And that's going to go ahead and fix the iPhone if it keeps on showing that Apple logo and turning off. Now, for some reason, let's say this isn't working, what you're going to do is go ahead and try to update it through iTunes on your MacBook or your PC using the iTunes uh, app that you can download, which I show you in another video because it does take a little bit more process into it, so you want to check that video out. But in any means, I hope this video is helpful in fixing your iPhone. If so, please consider like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone. We'll see you guys next time.